Well, in, in the past two days, you have picked me up in the rain, given me tea, bought me lunch, and lured me to this hideaway with the intention, I presume, of getting me into bed for what you Americans so charmingly call a quickie. Is that a fair raise you may so far? Why do women always think the worst? Why does sex always have to be the first thing that... Yes. Now, isn't that a touch of class? What he has is pure pizzazz. Plus a touch of class. George Siegel is Steve Blackburn, a very classy fellow. What about your wife? We've been married for 11 years, and not once in all that time have I ever been unfaithful to her in the same city. Where is she now? Out of town. Glenda Jackson is Vicky Alessio, a very classy girl. You know what you should have been, a worm. From their meeting in London. You're holding my ball. Oh, your ball. To their weekend in Spain. To their love nest in Soho. Is that bad? No, it isn't, is it isn't, is it really? I mean, it's got quite a distinct possibility. Sure, it is. Oh, God. Everything about them had a touch of class. Oh, oh yeah, she loves me. She told me so last night. Pardon me for asking, but did you always get what you want when you wanted it? Even before I knew what to do with it. She loves me. She told me so. Would you mind getting on the other side? Well, I don't want to make an international incident out of this, but it's more natural for me this side. How is it for you? Very nice. Very nice is hardly the phrase to describe two bodies locked in heavenly transport. I love you very much, and I can't seem to get you out of my mind. Steve! Ah! Ah! Oh, now! Now! George Siegel and Glenda Jackson in the greatest love story of our time. A touch of class. Oh, that's mine. You're not your heart,